This year on Creek to Coast, we've seen people take off-road camper trailers to some pretty remote locations, from Kalula to the back blocks of Land Cruiser Park to the very tip of Cape York. But never on this show have we taken one of these vehicles overseas. Well, that is until today. Well, the bridge to Bribey Island might not have been what you were thinking, but hey, technically, we're overseas. And although it's not miles away, we've come prepared for an adventure. Glenn Haddon from Low Range is a bit of a four-wheel drive guru, and he spent the last year travelling around the country testing out market direct campers. He claims that while they keep breaking cars, the campers keep holding up to what they put them through. Tell me a bit about, uh, about some of your travels. I've been from Cape York, uh, the Simpson Desert, Victorian high country through to Tasmania in some of the roughest conditions that you can imagine. MDC are the largest camper trailer manufacturer in Australia, but it's their new serious off-road caravan that's proving to be a winner. We're towing the XT10, the first off-road caravan ever to make it through the notorious Billy Goat Bluff track in the Victorian high country. The van has a narrow wheelbase, so it follows your tracks. And being only as wide as your vehicle, you can take it anywhere you're game enough to take your forby. Well, yeah, you can imagine taking through those rough tracks, pulling up to a campsite at night. You open the doors and there's your double bed all made. You've got LED lighting, you've got barbecues, you've got a fridge, you've got a shower. There's no better way to travel. There's not much more that you want, is there? No. Maybe just the next day's adventure in your mind. The next day's adventure, absolutely. After a good night's rest. And a cold beer in your hand. And two cold beers. <laughs> We're headed to the Poverty Creek Campground to meet up with a legend in the four-wheel driving community, John Ruthie Ruth. Yeah, excellent. You made it. We did. Oh, you didn't bring Dean with you. Oh, <laughs> here he is, the legend. <laughs> hey, you, made it. Good to see you. You may recognise him and his truck Milo from his four-wheel drive DVDs that are sold at BCF. Welcome to Low Range. It's all about touring Australia and touring the world. He's been on many off-road adventures around Australia with an MDC in tow and is a big fan of the XT10s. Ruthie's recently returned from a family holiday to the Cape where he put this one through its rigours. I gave it a hammering though, Dean. I did really it? did. Oh, yeah. yeah. You can't help it. The tracks are as corrugated as they ever get. Um, and we were flying too. I had my Hot Rod 76 and... Uh, we gave it everything. I was very impressed, actually, very impressed. I think the big thing comes back down to the suspension again because it's got coils and shock absorbers that actually work, that yeah. are rated to the weight of the thing. That means you can put your, um, well, in my case, you know, all my bottles of Vegemite, in your case, those three crates of red wine, <laughs> in the cupboards, and they won't all break. So is it all about research and development when you go on the road these days, or are you genuinely enjoying your travels? <laughs> oh, look, Dean, you know, because you've done a heap of travelling too, that it doesn't matter how much you travel in this country, you're always finding new stuff. And for me, that's the, just the sheer joy of it, you know? I, I, love, I love my country, I love feeling this country. And, uh, you know, something like this means you can go out and feel it in comfort. If you'd like to take a leaf out of Ruthie's book, then head to the MDC website and visit your nearest showroom. Whether it's the two or four berth XT10, the guys will kit out the caravan to suit your needs. They'll even throw in 1,800 bucks worth of solar panels for free if you mention that you saw them on Creek to Coast. Don't forget to keep an eye out for Glenn and Ruthie's adventures with low range on DVD at your nearest BCF. <laughs>